you love your Valentine's table to look like this and it costs next to nothing to do. Um, the whole of this, obviously, with some of my own bits and pieces, that has cost me really £10 only. All from Poundland, and I'm going to show you right now exactly how to do it. <laughs> Decorating for Valentine's. Sorry, I've got a bit of a light going on in my head there, haven't I? Um, I've put all the lights on to try and make it as 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 great as I can lighting wise. So I've got my. Um, if you can see, they look like gl um, glasses hanging out. Let me just go and turn the lights off. You might be able to see them better actually if I put it like that. Is that better? Can you see that better? So that is um, the lighting that's above our um, table so it might be better if I leave it like that a little bit darker so I'm going to show you how to dress can you see the light upside down wine glasses um, now my table I've moved the chairs from this side I'm only setting the table for two people I am going to be doing one nearer to Valentine's for uh, more people and that's going to be the one that's going to be set for my dining room table this one is red and white so it's the traditional colours of Valentine's however for my decor in my room I would go with pink and white which I'm going to do uh, just a little bit nearer the time. So uh, you can go with the plain uh, table if you wanted to. Uh, we've got wood and then I've had a piece of glass made to put on top of it to protect that wood. Now you're not going to believe this. This is one of my tips. Don't bother with tablecloths. Just go and get yourself a flat sheet. Yes, a flat bed sheet. That's all I use on top of my tables uh, whenever I've, I, I have a tablecloth. But I also have that um, beautiful white one that's made all of little sequins that I got from um, China. Uh, but this is the way that I dress a table. So I've just ironed it. <laughs> I'm going to, now there's probably a better way of throwing the tablecloth on, uh, but I never went to um, the school of waitresses, so I don't know how to do it. Now I have a feeling this might be a double, and if it is, then I could, no, 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 it's gonna be right, it's gonna be right. So. that out. So I dress my table with a white tablecloth. That is a flat sheet for a bit. <laughs> That's how simple that one was. Now I'm going to set the place settings up and actually I'm going to sit us in the middle here for two of us. I've got these from Poundland and you get two of these so I'm going to put one of these in each of the places. So one there and one there. Also got these plates and those are going to be great if you want to give sort of um, chocolates and things like that on Valentine's night. Maybe you've got people coming around for drinks or maybe you want to, I don't know, serve up a, a love heart poached egg in the morning. Um, but I'm going to put them in the middle of here because I think that looks absolutely adorable. <laughs> and so this is so cheap and cheerful. So, so far, um, obviously I've got bedspread, I've always got that in, but that's only cost me um, one, two, three pounds so far. So this is how easy it is to be able to do um, a table. Now obviously you'd need to wash these, I've just got them straight out of the bag, they wrap them in um, tissue paper for me. But these are the glasses, look, and they've got little love hearts all over them. So I'm gonna put one either side of here. And um, so this is gonna be um, a cheap and cheerful, but it's still gonna look really, really good. It's still gonna look absolutely fabulous, I think. Um, obviously I need my knife and fork. Coasters, but actually just put them on the table but I haven't finished yet. 
I've um, bought some uh, cheaper roses. These are real roses, and I'm going to place these down uh, the middle, like so. And then those are all your little candles um, in between. single rows <laughs> and then I've actually bought um, these from uh, Crownland as well. I'm not really into paper napkins but I just thought these were really cute and um, you could actually have these for serving drinks if you've got friends coming around um, or you could use them at the table. So they're little um, love hearts and I just need one each. And I'm going to take one of these beautiful roses and I'm actually just going to take the petals off and sprinkle those. So beautiful uh, candlelight. So all I've done is I've got these plate placemats from um, Poundland. I've got these plates from Poundland. I've got the cheap small roses from the supermarket and I've put one on obviously each plate. I've gone with the serviette um, in, the, in the love heart. I've gone with these love heart candles that actually come from Poundland. I've gone for the cheap roses and I've actually done this myself. I've not bought them. These are the real rose petals. I've put roses in each one of these. I've done my glitter Prosecco with the love heart on it. Love heart roses around there. Sprinkle the rest of it. Uh, tablecloth is just a um, is just a very simple flat sheet for a bed. And I've also gone for the love heart glasses. So a really really beautiful uh, centerpiece. And then these are just a pound from Hobbycraft. And then I've gone for red candles inside. You could even go with the uh, red love hearts again if you wanted to. But I quite like the love heart scattered. Um, around the table. Now obviously I'll put another chair here and I would remove the rest of the chairs um, but that is, let me see what it looks like with a big light on, I don't know whether it's going to look right or not or whether it'll look too much, um, but that is my Valentine's uh, Day um, table and I just think that looks so beautiful for when a loved one comes home and sees that. I think that's far more adorable than actually going out for dinner. I much prefer that. I've also, if you can see right in the um, in the conservatory, so I put all the lights on there, I'd light all the candles in there and I would leave the uh, red roses or I might even put them in here. Um, but just so beautiful and so easy, you could even leave a chocolate. But you could uh, chocolate chocolates for her or make chocolates for him and um, also as well don't forget this could be done right around the table this doesn't have to be just for um, two, two people this could actually be served for a whole host of you but what a beautiful setting to be able to propose to somebody or just tell them how much you love them i just think it's absolutely gorgeous and don't forget very very important it's really important to have the ambience right so that music must be playing uh, music must be romantic love songs etc uh, you might want some chill out kind of music on it depends on what you're into but that is 
beautiful and I'm so impressed and all in all of course the candles um, the the love hearts were from Poundland so they were a pound they were a pound that was a pound that was a pound each so one two three four five six seven pounds uh, and then I think the roses were three I'll find out now actually I'll find out now how much they were because they'll be on uh, three pounds so three pounds for the uh, so that all in all of course I've got all the um, the glassware but all in all that table um, without obviously the flat sheet as well that tables cost me ten pounds I think that's awesome don't forget to subscribe don't forget to give us a thumbs up I'll see you tomorrow oh I've got another Valentine's table that I'm doing but that's in pink and white and that's going to be my own table uh, I'm going to clear this and I'm going to set up a table um, uh, just a little bit nearer Valentine's for you to have a look at what my table on Valentine's is going to look like I'll see you later Thank you.